What's up? In this video, I'm going to be showing you two ways so that you can factory reset, also known as a hard reset, your Apple iPhone Air. Let's go. Welcome back to the video. My name is Sergio and in this channel I make life-saving tech videos. So if you're new here, feel free to subscribe and hit the bell while you're down there. All right, let's jump right into it. So I'm going to show you two ways so that you can do a factory reset on your iPhone. So first I'll show you how to do it through the settings if you can log into your phone. And then I'll also show you how to do it with the buttons so in case you have a password and uh, you forgot it and you can't get into your phone or if your phone is unavailable like this, completely blocked, uh, you'll be able to do a factory reset, erase everything on your phone back to its factory condition so that you can start using it normally again. All right, so first let's, let's show you how to do it through the settings. So go into settings. Here in settings, you're gonna scroll to general. Okay, here in general, you're gonna scroll all the way to the bottom and uh, right here, it's gonna say transfer or reset iPhone. So here we're gonna select erase all content and settings. All right, uh, here it's, it's just letting you know that uh, this will erase everything on your phone, all your personal data, apps, everything. So I suggest if there's things in your phone that you wanna keep, uh, I suggest you back up your iPhone first because once again, this will erase everything on your phone back to its factory condition. Once you're ready, hit continue, hit erase iPhone. It's gonna ask you for your password if you have one to confirm and then the reset process will begin. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how to do it in the event that you have a password and uh, your phone is locked or I'm gonna show you how to do it out of this screen uh, so that you can also factory reset your iPhone. So what you're gonna need for this method though is you're gonna need a computer. This works on either Windows or Mac. In this video, I'll, I'll be showing you how to do it on a Mac. I'll have a different video showing you how to do it on a Windows. But essentially what you'll need to do is you'll need to connect it to your computer with a USB uh, Type-C cable. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna press volume up, volume down, and then we're gonna press and hold the power lock button or Siri button until the phone shuts off. Once the phone shuts off, we're gonna release the power lock button and we're gonna press and hold volume up and the power lock button at the same time until the iPhone enters restore mode. All right, so let's go ahead and do it now. So volume up, volume down, power lock button until the phone shuts off. Once it does release and press and hold volume up and power lock button. And now we're gonna continue to hold these two buttons simultaneously until restore mode appears. You're gonna see the Apple logo, just continue holding. And then once you see this, you can release. This is the Apple restore mode. Okay, and uh, we're gonna receive this message on the computer. It's gonna say a software update is required to connect to your iOS device, select install. So first it's gonna download, it's gonna download the iOS software because it's gonna erase everything on your phone, even the software, and it's gonna reinstall the uh, iOS software on the phone. Okay, so this will take a few seconds, maybe a few minutes, depending on the speed of your internet connection. Um, so allow it to download completely first. All right, so there you go. Uh, it's reading the iPhone now. It says, could not contact the iPhone software update server because you're not connected to the internet. So just hit okay. Um, so here, uh, all we gotta do is, uh, you can either hit update or restore iPhone, same thing. So just hit uh, restore iPhone. Here it's gonna let you know, are you sure you want to reset the iPhone because uh, to factory settings because everything will be deleted. So once you're ready, hit restore and update. Okay, here you just have to confirm by hitting next and then agree to the terms and conditions. Hit agree. Okay, so now uh, now it's looking like it's downloading uh, the actual iPhone software update. So it says 10 minutes here. So I'm gonna give it some time and allow it to finish downloading. All right, so as we can see, uh, the software update is downloaded. So now it's just uh, loading it up here. Okay, so it's uh, moved on to the next step, which is extracting software. Uh, so now it's gonna give us a couple different uh, loading bars. Okay, one is extracting software, the other one will be like verifying software and a couple loading bars. Once they're all through, the uh, factory reset process or hard reset will be complete. So let's give it some time here for it to uh, finish uh, all of the loading bars. Okay, cool. So uh, I'm glad that this happened because uh, this will happen the majority of the times, especially if uh, your software took a little bit longer than normal to download. Uh, the iPhone is going to get out of restore mode. Uh, so it's just going to go back to this uh, and you're going to have to put it back into restore mode so that it can continue the uh, reset process. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, put it one more time into restore mode. So same steps, volume up, volume down, power lock button. 
it looks like it's still trying to uh, finish the process here on the computer though it's, it says extracting software i'm not sure what uh, you know what how it's extracting the software if we're out of restore mode so so don't mind uh, what it's doing on the computer here let's just go ahead and uh, put it back into restore mode so volume up volume down power lock button okay when the screen turns black we release and press volume up and power lock button okay so just continue to hold them uh, until the iPhone goes back into restore mode okay there we go now we can release so on the computer here, it still says extracting software. Let's give it some time here for it to uh, read the iPhone. So on the computer here, it says preparing iPhone for restore. Let's see what it shows now on the iPhone. If it shows loading bars, then we're good. If not, then it's just gonna go back. It's gonna turn back on and we're gonna have to put it back into restore mode. Okay, there we go. So once you see the loading bar here on the iPhone itself, you are good to go. Uh, the reset process is communicating properly with the computer. So now we'll just allow all of the loading bars, like I said, once again, uh, completely load. And once they all load, the reset process will be complete. So as you can see, it's uh, at restoring iPhone firmware. All right, so now it's verifying iPhone restore. So the loading bar is almost done on the iPhone here. So we're getting close to the end of the process. Okay, so now it's verifying iPhone restore. All right, so the iPhone's uh, showing the Apple logo now. Looks like it's booting back on. I think we're gonna get one more quick loading bar. And then after that one, uh, the process is complete. Yep, there you go. So this is the final loading bar. And there we go. So now we get the message on the computer here, which says your iPhone has been restored to factory settings and is restarting. Please leave your iPhone connected. All right, so that means that the process is complete. Although let's leave it connected with the cable here until uh, this process completes on the iPhone itself. All right, so let's just finish, let's just let the iPhone bar here finish loading. All right, and there we go. So uh, after a couple seconds or, or a minute or two, uh, the iPhone will complete the process here on the loading bar and will boot on automatically. And now you're at the initial setup of your Apple iPhone. Okay, so all you gotta do is go through the setup steps here uh, to get your iPhone set up so that you can start using it normally again. So once you see this, uh, you can go ahead and disconnect it. You're good to go. And uh, yeah, just continue the process here to get your iPhone set up. All right, everyone, so there you go. That is how you factory reset, also known as hard reset, your Apple iPhone Air. Go ahead and destroy that like button if this video helped you and comment down below and let me know. So that's all for this video. I'll catch you in the next one. As always, peace.